Hello friends, my name is Bhushan. In the last two videos, I have shown you how to insert values to your MySQL database by writing a Java code. So in this video, I will show you how to display the database values in a label. So let's get started. First of all, let's open up your NetBeans IDE and uh, select your JFrame form and go to design view. First of all, let's take three labels and take one button and change the button text so display okay now give a name to your labels it is id and name and age so now that we have created the labels and a button so our goal is to we need to display the database values in these three labels as soon as we click the display button so which means that we need to write a code inside the button so for that we need to create an event so select your display button go to events action action perform so now we created the event so inside the event first of all let's make a try catch block try catch exception e inside the catch let's write j option pane dot show show message dialog and the first parameter is null and the second parameter is e so inside the try block first of all let's write our query string sql is equal to inside the double quotes let's write select star from table name here in this case my table name is details so in the next line let's write pst is equal to con dot prepare statement so we are preparing a sql statement using a prepare statement method and the result will be stored in a prepare statement object pst so in the next line let's write rs is equal to pst dot execute query so using the execute query method we will execute the query and the result will be stored in the result set object rs so using the result set object we will display the database values in a labels so in the next line let's write while rs dot next so inside the loop first of all let's make a string object string a is equal to rs dot get string inside the get string let's write your column names so here in this case my column name is student id so basically what i'm doing is using a get string method i'm accepting the value from the column that is student id and assigning to a string object a so now we need to display this string object using a set text method in a label so in the next line let's write your label name that is id dot set text and your string object name here in this case my string object name is a so in this way do it for all the labels so in the next line let's again write string b is equal to rs dot get string so inside the double quotes let's write your column names that is student name in the next line let's write your label name that is name and set text and your object name so again create an object string object that is c and rs dot get string so inside the get string let's write your another column name that is student age and in the next line again write your uh, label name that is age and set text and your string object name so finally we return a code for displaying the values to a uh, displaying a database values in a label so let's see uh, let's save the program and uh, run the program let's see what happens save the program and run the file so connection has has been established so let's click the display button so here are the values so in this way 
uh, we will display the database values in a labels i hope you understand this uh, tutorial so in the next video i will show you how to uh, use a reset button and how to clear the uh, text field values after inserting the values so i will see you in the next video thanks for watching